Hey guys! So I am currently home. It is my day off, but there is like a snowstorm outside. It's my boyfriend's birthday and it's like legit a snowstorm. Um, and so I'm just chilling inside, but it is like so bright outside because so much snow. It's just so white. It's so, you know, just so freaking bright. So I'm sitting here with a giant blanket scarf around me wearing a sweater, sitting by my tree. And I actually received my Kylie Cosmetic order today. So I figured I'd do like a little mini makeup haul. It has some things from MAC. Um, drugstore, ColourPop, and Kylie Cosmetics. So it's not too many things, it's just a quick little haul, but I figured I'd give you my thoughts on the things that I have tried, and we'll just, you know, we'll go through the stuff that I bought recently. But we're gonna start with the two drugstore things. So I seen Tati Westbrook um, mention this in a video. This is the Essence Pure Nude Highlighter. So it looks like this. I first put this on my face and I was like, what is that? It doesn't do anything. It looks like my skin. Then I used it with Fix Plus and it made a world of difference. So you can see it there. Like it has a color to it, but it doesn't have like a great amount of shine unless you use it with something else. So this was $5.50. It's not a bad product. I don't know if I'll repurchase it, but it's not a bad product. Like, you can make it work. It's just that you have to kind of, like, baby it to get it to work, which isn't always my favorite thing to do, you know? Like, have to really work for something, which sounds really, really silly. Another thing that I have from the drugstore is a repurchase, and it is the Milani um, Prime Shield Face Primer. I have bought this probably four times now. I actually quite like it. It has that like silicone feel, so some people don't like that, but I don't mind it. I find that it hides my pores really well. Obviously, this one says it is mattifying and pore minimizing, so that is exactly what it should be doing. So I like that as well, and I'm pretty sure this is $10.99. My few things from MAC. So I went in when they were doing that 25% off for select members, and I bought two things. I went in not knowing what lipstick I wanted, I just wanted a new lipstick. And I was talking with the girl and we tried a whole bunch on my hand, I had like 13 swatches on my hand or something. And I told her like about the formulas that I like and the colors that I like from MAC and like their different formulas. So we ended up settling on Fast Play. And it's just a regular one in their, you know, collection that's always there and it just looks like this. Kind of like a mauve brownie nude. Yeah, just like that. These are cat scratches, by the way. And then I also got the regular size version of Fix Plus because I literally use this for everything. I should have bought more, I just didn't, but it saved me like $7, which is like, you know, just awesome. So I live by this delicious smelling, helpful liquid. Okay, so then from ColourPop, I'm actually wearing one of the lip glosses that I bought. This is the Ultra, Ultra <laughs> the Ultra Glossy Lip in My Jam. And I really, really love this. It just looks like this. It's this one here. And you can see the like shine and the glossiness. And I don't find these sticky at all. And I'm such a huge fan of that. This looks great by itself. Like I just have it right now by itself or over top of like anything it looks so good and then I bought one of the ultra glossy lips from the holiday collection so this is a nonsense looks like this just beautiful but again I friggin love this so it's this guy right here this again I didn't think would look good by itself looks bomb by itself or over something and also this packaging though like, I'm almost thinking we should just make the switch permanent. Like, I'm all about the black topper, the kind of, like, more frosted matte finish. I'm all about it. I love it. And then the writing in black just looks so sleek, right? Like, so good. And then I also bought a highlighter. Um, this is Monster by ColourPop, obviously. Looks like this. Um, I had heard so many good things from Jeffree Star about this. I sound like I know him. No, in his videos. Um, 
And to be honest, I haven't quite figured out how to wear it on myself yet. So it's this guy right here. It's very pinky, holographic. Um, I almost think it'd be better as like a highlight topper, like to use... I don't know like a cream or something and then to put this over top of it just to get that like color instead of building this up and only having that I think it'd be better as a topper like it very much has that kind of like it almost matches the lip gloss there like I just need to figure out how to wear it it's beautiful it shines um, it's not like a chunky shine it's a beautiful shine it is a really nice product it's just that I haven't figured out how to wear it on myself yet I forgot prices on these things this was $15.75 I think with the 25% off this was 20 something these two bad boys I believe were both six dollars and this one was eight and now on to my Kylie cosmetic stuff so I put this lip gloss on I was gonna leave it on for the video I literally had it on for less than a minute and it was feathering up around my mouth I'm 23 years old about to turn 24 I don't have very many fine lines around my mouth. I really don't think so. Um, I just don't. I don't think so. Like, I don't think that there's that much there. Um, but it was, like, up and over. I had to take it off immediately. I, like, showed my boyfriend, and he was like, what's going on with it? So that's how I feel about that. It is a beautiful color, though. Like, it is stunning. Um, I really like the wand on it. Also, if you hear a lot of loud sounds, it's because cars are trying to get up my hill right now. Or, well, my road right now. And they can't because it's too snowy. So this is the swatch of that. And, I mean, obviously, I ordered it because it looks like this. Like, it looks so stunning. Um, but I found it a little bit gloppy. I'm not mad at it for that. I'm mad at it for the feathering. But I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to make it look just beautiful. So I got that. I actually put the little canister because it came in like an ornament canister I put it on my tree because it matches my tree and I purchased finally a Kylie Cosmetics eyeshadow palette I got the holiday one because I mean the colors were just stunning like you've seen the swatches on her in on her Instagram her snapchat and like you died so this is what the inside of it looks like it is just so beautiful after I ordered this, I saw only bad things about it. So I haven't tried this. I literally have no opinion on the eyeshadows. I haven't even swatched them. I personally love the way that this looks, so we're gonna have to friggin' see. But I might do a first impression on it. Maybe tomorrow. I don't know. I kind of want to just to be like to really get my opinion, like as I'm literally trying it. Because I love the way that they look, but like I haven't heard great things. Cars are literally going sideways on my road. Why are you out driving? So I don't really have an opinion about this. I don't have too much of one about this other than the fact that I probably shouldn't have put it on and then been mad at it. But anyways, it happens. Um, I ordered these on Black Friday. I received them today. So that would be, I ordered them the 20, whatever the Black Friday was. Um, and then I received them on December 12th. So it was about two weeks, yeah, for shipping to Canada. So this was $15, the glosses are, and this was $42. Those are both U.S. prices. So $15 is about like $18, $19, and this is just about $60. So also, this is way smaller than I thought. I Like I've seen tons and tons of stuff about this, but this is like, the size of my hand. For some reason, I thought it was gonna be bigger. I'm not disappointed in the size of like the pans. I just thought the palette was bigger for some reason. So anyways, so that is my mini makeup haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Um, I know that there wasn't like too much to it, but I didn't wanna forget that I had this newer stuff. I kinda wanted to like put it on here and give you like my quick opinions on it. Um, in case you're still, you know, trying to order last minute things for Christmas, like there is still time for that kind of stuff. I would even be able to order stuff from any of these websites and get it before Christmas and Canada can be a little bit trickier with shipping. So those are my opinions. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, I hope I wasn't too distracting staring out the wind, like me staring out the window because I just, I can't stop because people are like doing crazy things down there. <laughs> Thank you so much for hanging out with me and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.